here earlier. Good evening, sir. I'm just curious. Okay, you, you have a twenty dollar ticket. Mm -hmm. It has not even doubled. It's still twenty dollars. You've been here for two hours for a twenty dollar ticket. It's probably costing you money to be here. I'm trying to go to law so, school. So I can't wait for this explanation. I'm on the edge of my seat. This ha this is going to be a good one. I can tell. What is it? What is your explanation, sir? For the ticket. No, uh, for, for, for world affairs, right? What do you think the U.N. is going to do tomorrow? I mean, of course the ticket. What do you think you're here for? Um, I work as a pizza guy until 4, and I deliver to PC. also go there. Um, so I'm making my deliveries. I park at that spot. Well, you're right off Huxley. All right, you're a pizza guy? Yeah. You deliver pizza? Mm hmm When you're delivering pizza, do you speed? Sometimes. Depends on the customer. Sometimes. Yeah. Nice tip? Right. Sure. Nice to respect it. Carrigan, right? He's admitted to speeding, right? So far, yes, Your Honor. Does anyone want to go to law school? Not too well so far. <laughs> what year are you in school? This is, I'm a freshman this year. You're a freshman, and you want to be a lawyer? Yeah. Yeah. What, what type of law are you uh, contemplating studying? Litigation. What is it? Litigation. You mean you want to be a trial lawyer? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So the first thing you do when you want to be a trial lawyer, if you want to be a trial lawyer, and I, I, I think you, you could be quite successful because you make a nice appearance, except you don't say yeah in court, you say yes, Your Honor, or no, Your Honor, right? You speak coherently, you make a cogent argument. So let me hear your argument now. You're before the court. Say, Your Honor, I wish to present the following evidence in my defense. Let me hear you say that. Your Honor, I wish to present the following evidence in my defense. Oh, what is, your, what is this evidence, sir? Um, uh, okay. okay. <laughs> I've got the ticket here that says um, I was hit with the radar at 2.33. I work until 4 a.m. So, like, those are my hours. I don't really. I can get a printout if you want. Oh, so you admit the offense that you were parked there at 2.33 in the evening. Well, the charge says it's for overnight parking. I was now parked overnight. How long were you there? Like 10 minutes. I park on campus. Why did, why did I have to extricate that from you? <laughs> Want to try again? Sure. Let's go. Let's Come on. Hurry up. I'm waiting. Your Honor, the, the charge for an overnight infraction when I was only parked there for 10 minutes. Okay. Good. Now, so on that basis, the question is, now it's a question of credibility. It's a question of whether I believe you. And for that, I go to Inspector Carrigan. Inspector Carrigan, do you believe him? No. Yeah. <laughs> he, be, he believes you. He yes, believes Your Honor. I mean, I understand it, but what else is he supposed to do, Your Honor? I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm probably going to dismiss the case, depending on whether or not you're honest. So I'm going to ask you a question. Okay. Right. Was there ever a time when you were so hungry and you were delivering pizza that you actually took a piece of pizza and ate it? No, sir. Never? Nope. I'm not sure I believe that. <laughs> Uh, it's one ticket. It's a twenty-dollar ticket. It's overnight parking. I believe him that he wasn't there overnight. That he just was delivering pizza. He was there for ten minutes. Good luck. Wish you well in law school. Thank you.